We are currently under a tornado warning. Please stay away from the glass windows and doors of the exhibit hall. channel um today is uh attempt number two at trying to see the rocket launch uh, my tickets are still good uh, according to what the website says we get two tries at it so this will be my second try and uh after that i'm not quite clear i gotta call and see but there will be no after that because I have plans, so I won't be able to do another one. I'll just try to get a refund. But as you saw from the previous clip, uh, it was a productive morning. I washed my van really, really good. Even got up under the uh, van really good and cleaned that because I was at the beach. Um, just trying to maintain my van so that it can uh, last a long time without rust. And what the maintenance guy told me, hey, every time you know you go to a car wash, just get up under the undercarriage you know the water's not going to hurt it you just you know make sure you get keep it clean of salt so that you prevent rust and calcium buildup so this morning and also i want to take care of the body of my van because i do go to a lot of beaches and uh salt is a real issue when it comes to rust and destroying paint so uh i'm i try to make it a point now to go at least once a week to wash my van uh even if it's to rinse it down with water and to get under the van um so also uh, I went and got my feet done. I usually try to go once a month, but I waited two months to get it done. Um, also, I noticed uh, my generator, it says no fault, no fault, which means in theory, there's nothing wrong with the generator. Uh, I'm not gonna touch it though. I do have an appointment May 2nd and I don't want to keep trying to aggravate the generator and try to turn it on. I'm going to let them do them. Uh, I'm going to let them try it. If it turns on, it turns on. I'm going to let them know kind of the symptoms and what's been going on with it. And hopefully they can still inspect it. Um, I did talk to the warranty people. I am still under warranty with the generator. Now, he did say that for the generator, it is a year warranty for the generator. So uh, if there's any issues with it, the, the shop I'm going to, they are ACH qualified. And I will be under warrantied, uh, covered under warranty to get it fixed if there's anything wrong with it. But like I said... The fault went away and now it says no fault which means the generator is fine but i am not going to attempt to turn it on for fear that i might make it worse if there is something looming so what's next um we're gonna make our way to the kennedy space center um it did here so I'm crossing my fingers that our boy Elon doesn't cancel
look how cool that looks even if elon musk cancels like i said i'm still gonna be happy to be here i hope he doesn't though but i talked to a guy from the united kingdom and he says that storms are coming wind conditions and things but look how beautiful that is all right let's go see what we have to do to get in wow heroes and legends united states astronaut hall of fame presented by bowen not beautiful family for those of you who have never seen it, you guys get to see it with me for the first time. What an honor and a privilege. What an honor and a privilege. This is super, super cool. I mean, to see these rockets up close is freaking incredible. Like, check this out. Aiming at the heavens. There's the rocket data. I mean, would you look at the scale? I am in an awe. Don't worry. I got sunscreen on, fam. I was prepared. Check this one out. What is this called? Let's check this one out. Look at the scale. Look at the scale. that big on TV but you like in person it's just like... what I've noticed is that NASA has the world working here I just talked to someone who worked here and her accent I couldn't even focus it was freaking amazing I, I don't know if it was Australian I don't know what kind of accent it was gorge okay this is the Mars Rover um, check it out what Mars Rover look at that this is the front. Look at those tires. Let's go see around the side. Mars Rover Vehicle Navigator. So I don't think anybody goes in there, right? Right? Here's the... I mean, look how beautiful that is. Okay, now we're gonna go into this building supposed to be like all things space exploration and like the latest innovative space uh, inventions that I guess the US collaborated with uh, other countries with so this is new let's go in Taking a break, it's hot. I brought water.
Ooh. I'm about to check and see if our boy Elon canceled uh, the rocket launch yet. Because this time yesterday he had canceled it already. But let's see what it's looking like for today. Um, it's not canceled. It's still going. So far nothing has been canceled. But these things can get canceled up right at the time it's supposed to go. But so far, um, no cancellation. There's still a go. So we're gonna go inside of here. We're going in there. Look how massive. There's no. Jeez, look how huge that is. Wow. It's gorgeous. I mean, look at the wingspan. That is huge. It's where all the fire and everything comes out. Lord, that's a lot. Okay, it's time to get some ice cream. I'm done. I'm done with the exhibits. I'm ready for the rocket launch. Hopefully it continues. It hasn't been canceled yet, so I'm gonna go grab some ice cream. I'll see you guys in a bit. told me to sit on the left side of the window so I can potentially see alligators. So I'm gonna sit on the left side. Hopefully there's a spot by the window. So let's go. We 
made it and uh, just gonna go to the bleachers and chill until it happens or it doesn't happen but I'm super excited we're here we are here the rocket launch is in approximately two and a half hours still has not been canceled I'm gonna head to the top of the bleachers or the bleachers know where to go so wherever the photographers are going I'm going Okay, we're moving inside the building. It's starting to rain, thunder, all that. No lightning, but rain. But we're still on for the, the launch, so hopefully it's uh, just a little bit of rain and it passes. Uh, my, my weather app said it's going to pass in like 25 minutes. So, yeah, let me show you the countdown clock. This is the all official right, so, countdown uh, clock. We did so you do have a meal that's included with that. That is set up inside the building. So there's lightning in the area, so we have to go in the building. We do get a free meal, so I'm going to go see what it is. Uh, you know, I'm picky about my food, so I'd rather save my calories for something good. But uh, I did. I saw an alligator on the way here. It was a baby alligator, my first alligator. It was so cute, floating in the little water. I was so scared, though. All right, let's go inside and see what this meal was looking like. You are such troopers. Let's see what it looks like inside. Oh, wow. Wasn't that amazing? That is super cool. I mean, this that's the biggest ship rocket ship I've ever seen in my life. Um, we get a, was this a complimentary meal? Or is this a souvenir? Cause you know, your girl doesn't want any extra stuff. But let me just get in line and see what this is. So this is the souvenir line. You get a free souvenir. And a free meal, so. Let's see what the souvenir is. It's a one, once in a lifetime for me. I'm not coming back. And then uh, we'll see what the free meal is. I think it's, I think the souvenir is a cup. Do I want it? Take you right here. Oh, really, Charlie? You missed that. That means I get two. Not <laughs> Give her one. Thank <laughs> you. We will take a look at what this is later. It's a cup, but we'll see what it looks like. 
Uh, I'm gonna just throw it in my bag. Thank heavens I bought a bag. I'm so happy. So now, oh, I smell the food. It smells delicious, actually. Let's go get some food. Now we're in line for our free meal, and they will punch the card. The, I'm almost up there. Uh, looks like you get some, like just like a cookie or something. You know I'm a, I love sweets, so we're gonna try that. But here's the line. So I'll see you guys after I get my food. Hopefully it's good. So this was dinner. Uh, you make your own bowl. So I added Spanish rice, uh, pulled beef and pulled chicken, I think. It was free. I didn't really enjoy it. I didn't finish it. I ate a little bit of it, but uh, all in all, that was what I had for dinner. So the rocket launch went from 729 to 826. That's the last window to ro launch a rocket. That is the last window, 826. It's still raining really heavy, heavy thunder, lightning. Uh, there's flooding in uh, this area, a possible tornado. So we're on hold. But we're in NASA, we're inside the building, so I feel safe here. I just hope my van is okay. I want my baby. So the last window of the rocket can launch is at 826, and uh, that's what they pushed it to. I'll keep you guys posted. See you guys shortly. Okay, they just announced we're under a tornado warning, so I'm from Texas. I'm used to this. But like I said, we're in NASA. This building is solid, so I'm not really worried. I just hope my van is okay. And I'm in the wrong county. <laughs> I'm in the wrong county. Oh, oh man. And there goes the tornado warnings. There they go, moving us away from the windows. I don't know if this rocket launch is going to happen at 826. Uh, let's hope. Right. <laughs> Picture, are we good? Oh, I'm not taking pictures. I'm, t I'm just talking to the camera. Uh, thank you, though. Uh, I'm not trying to die over a picture. <laughs> but yeah, so um, I'll keep you guys posted. Check out the lightning show. Okay, I'm back and I literally don't know what I'm gonna do as far as where I'm gonna sleep tonight. Uh, not only are we under a tornado warning that was just announced, that's why we gotta stay away from the windows. Um, we are also under flooding in this county. I literally don't know where I'm gonna be sleeping tonight. Uh, it looks really bad out. We know Florida weather is off and on like a light switch, but man, this is pretty bad. And uh, flooding, I do have all train tires, um, but my vehicle is not lifted, so I literally don't know. I'm not gonna worry too much. I just feel like everything will work out. And uh, I'm just, I don't know. I, I'm not even concerned about the rocket launch no more as so much as where I'm gonna sleep. looking good it looks pretty bad out there I mean it's coming down really hard like this is bad I'm a smidge to worry just a smidge
They moved the launch back till tomorrow. But I can't do it tomorrow. I have something planned tomorrow that's already paid for, so I'm just out of <laughs> I'm out of 250 bucks. I literally cannot come tomorrow. I have something that I'm doing tomorrow that I've already paid for. Tomorrow and the next day. It's, uh yeah there's that so uh we're still under a tornado warning and lightning and all that so we still can't leave but i will update you guys when i am back at my van ah i knew the risk when i bought the ticket so i will see you guys shortly So I wasn't able to check rocket launch off my bucket list as it is definitely a bucket list item. I am super sad that the launch didn't happen today. The weather was just too bad. We were under several tornado warnings, a flood warning. It was horrible. The wind was extremely high. Trees were bending, trash cans were flying, doors were opening and closing. It was pretty bad out there. Just tons of lightning, thunder, everything. You name it, rain was just pouring down. So it did rock and launch naturally was not going to happen. Um, so I did take a big hit uh, on uh, paying for the ticket and parking and stuff. I am not able to get a refund as I did get my rocket launch tickets uh, scanned. So it clearly states on the website, if your ticket is scanned for any reason, you are not able to get a refund. All in all, it's, you know, I'm sad about that, but it's okay. I had a good time. I talked to some cool people. I saw some cool exhibits. Dinner sucked. Uh, I had a, a range of experiences, uh, ones that I'll take with me forever. Um, I am still going to uh, attempt to see a rocket launch at some point in my life, but it will not be anytime soon. They are giving us an opportunity to see a launch tomorrow if it happens, uh, but I can't because I already have plans tomorrow for the next couple days that it's already been paid for and I've been looking forward to doing this. So I won't be able to to see the, try and see a launch tomorrow. And on this, honestly, I don't think it's going to happen because the weather is supposed to be just as bad tomorrow as it was today. So there's that. I all in all I enjoyed myself. Um, I took you guys with me and hopefully you guys enjoyed hanging out with me. Uh, thank you guys so much for just hanging out with me. You could have been doing anything, but you took a little bit of your day, out, a little bit of time out of your day just to hang out with me and that means the world to me. Um, I appreciate you guys more than you know. And like I always say, I have literally have the best community on YouTube. When I drop a video, you guys show up and show out. And because of that, liking and commenting and just engaging with the video, we get more community members. Um, to the channel youtube pushes the video out and more community members come so thank you thank you so much for everything that you have done uh it means the world to me but it's time for me to go to bed so i'm out of here thanks for watching and as always i will see you guys in my next video take care peace out